I mean, all of us knew this day was coming, you included, of course, but you know, now that it's actually here, there's got to be a lot of things going on in your mind, emotions-wise, and, and thinking about the future. Yeah, I'm just I'm happy for you know my family, and uh, it was just one of the best days of my life, just sitting there with my, my friends and family and finally getting my name called. Um, I've been waiting for it for 21 years, and uh, it's a dream come true for me today. Uh, I'll never forget this day. It's been awesome so far. Any thoughts about maybe staying? around or is this already a decision that's been made that, that you want to go you know play for the organ the Detroit organization uh, there hadn't been any decisions made I still got to sit down with my family and, and talk about the options and weigh the options uh, obviously I've enjoyed every second playing at Carolina and uh, it's, it's going to be hard if, if those decisions made to play for the Tigers it's going to be hard to take that jersey off and, and never wear it again but I'm just grateful to, to the Tigers for giving me an opportunity and thankful to God for giving me the opportunity to, to play for the Tigers if that's what I decide to do. And one of your other buddies there, Pancake, go, gets, gets the name called a few rounds later, yeah. same place. I mean, it's a pretty good deal to, to be reunited with one of your friends. Yeah, I was just hoping I would know someone in the organization, whatever, whoever picked me. I was just hoping I would know someone that's already there or something. But uh, the fact that Joey got selected a few rounds after me and uh, we get to continue our journey together. I mean, we've been pushing each other for three years to be the best we can be, and now uh, if that's what both of us decide to do, we'll get to be uh, get to be together again within the Tigers organization. So I'm really happy for him and his family, and we've been in touch all day, so I'm um, ready to get started with him. Montgomery, too, getting picked by the Yankees short mm -hmm. time after you, and uh, all these guys in the junior class are probably going to get their names called here mm -hmm. over, over the next day, tomorrow, and you guys accomplished a lot. Mm -hmm. Have you thought about that 136 wins you know the college world series so many things you've done yeah uh, we came in together and uh, we, we set some goals together and we just pushed each other to, to be the best we could be as a team and individually and um, you know today and this this three-day event's kind of a testament to our hard work and, and the talent that this class had and um, hopefully th those guys get their names called again tomorrow because I mean it's it's a once in a lifetime thing it's not every day you get drafted so um, I'm praying hard for for Joel and for for Tanner and Kyle and those guys to hear their names tomorrow. Um, and if not, it's, it's in God's plan. So um, I'm just praying hard for those guys. Well, we wish you the best. Congrats. I got a question for you too Sorry. about, um, you know, obviously you got some work to do before you make it to the bigs, but mm -hmm. Brad Osmus, you yeah. know, how cool That's was right. that? Yeah. Great That's catcher cool. in the bigs. You know, how, how neat is that to be joining an organization that is pretty much run by one of the catcher. one yeah. of the greatest catchers yeah. probably played in the game. Yeah, that's really cool. Uh, Joel Seddon, actually, my roommate, uh, he's been my roommate for three years. He's from Detroit area. He lives right outside of Detroit, so he's a big Tigers fan. So, um, Brad Osmus, I mean, he's I grew up watching him catch. He's obviously a great catcher and obviously a, a really good manager. Uh, Detroit's having another fantastic year and. Um, Got a lot of work to do to get to that point. That's, if it happens, that's a long ways down the road. But uh, it is pretty cool that you know the, the head team of the organization I got drafted to is, is a catcher that I grew up watching. So that's really cool. And how did, how did last night go? Because, I mean, many people probably thought that you should have been off the board last night. I mean, anxious, frustrated at all? I mean, that you didn't see your name called and had to wait till that second day? Uh, just kind of the competitive side of me. Uh, I was a little, you know, just mad at myself for not putting myself in position to be a, a day one draft pick. But I mean, after a few minutes, I was fine and I was just excited for today and get to spend the day with my family. And um, I, I would have been a little frustrated if I didn't get a call today. But uh, I was thankful for the opportunity and um, just glad it was. It wasn't that that frustrated last night. It was. I got to see a lot of my Team USA teammates get selected last night, which was really cool. So it was, it was a good night.